Hey, welcome into New World News, and unfortunately, some more bad news. Several more states, two and a third, including the District of Columbia, Washington, D.C., have now topped out at a gas average over $5 a gallon. And according to experts, it is not expected to come down any time soon. So many, many states reached that four and a half to five dollar a gallon mark, uh, which is nearly a dollar more or over a dollar more than it was just at the beginning of this year when gas was down in the 350s to 375s. And if we go back just even a several couple years, we were down in the 250 to three dollar range. So double what it was just a few years ago, which is insane considering it's just been that short amount of time. The inflation, everything happening is just crushing the American consumer. Sales are down across the board. Everything going haywire. And it doesn't look like it's going to get any better. What's the old saying? It's going to get worse before it gets better. If you have cash, save your cash. Save your money. Cash is king. Don't run out. Don't need to borrow money. Otherwise, you're going to be borrowing at an, an extraordinary level of interest. Keep your money and get through this and then you'll have opportunity to buy really cheap and make money and get yourself in a better situation. Let's go over and check out the gas crisis story over on the iPad. Okay, this story out of NPR from Bill Chappelle. Ten states now have gallons of gas costing more than $5 a piece. This picture, 725, 45, and 775, is from Menlo Park, California. That is near Apple. That is up north, northern California, where Tech and Silicon Valley are. U.S. prices hit a new record on Monday with a gallon of regular gas costing an average of $4.86, not adjusting for inflation. According to AAA, the most recent data, the highest average price is $6.34 is California, and 10 states have now surpassed the $5 mark. The higher prices hit, uh, hit hard in the past week when Americans hit the roads and highways for Memorial Day weekend. People are still feeling up despite these high prices. At some point, drivers may change their daily driving habits or lifestyle due to these high prices, but we're not there yet. We should be there. Consumers are paying more around the country. No state's average is below 428, according to AAA. Parts of the West, Midwest, and Northeast are seeing some of the nation's highest gas costs. Here are the five states with the highest gas costs. Of course, it's California, Nevada, Hawaii, Oregon, and Washington. That is the West Coast for some reason. They're always the highest. 634, 549, 547. Of course, Hawaii has to get the gas out there. 541 and 540. The District of Columbia, the average cost is 506. The biggest weekly shock came in states such as Michigan, Illinois and Indiana, all of which saw a 40 cent rise. Another nine states seem poised to hit the $5 threshold, including Pennsylvania and Massachusetts. Oil and gas companies want to boost the production. Um, Consumer Energy Alliance President David Halt has called for the ramping up of U.S. oil and gas production, and we are in unprecedented territory with gasoline prices headed for a national average of $5 a gallon. And then this, it's not as bad as earlier spikes in gas prices, the EIA says. Despite the eye-popping numbers being put on the gas station signs, the EIA says that as a percentage of disposable personal income, gasoline costs are still only a little higher than the average since 2015. And it says they're lower than in previous times when oil prices soared past $100 per barrel. The share of disposable personal income allocated to gas, gasoline expenditures reached its peak in 2008, just before the onset of the global financial crisis, when oil prices were at record highs. The average U.S. household will have to spend around $450 more for gas this year than they did in 2021 on inflation-adjusted basis. That's an extra $40, 35 to $40 per month. So, no, it's not crippling, but it does add up. $450 for the year adds up. That's one, you know, one half of a paycheck, one paycheck, one whatever it is. It could cost, you know, smaller families, smaller earners uh, a good chunk of money. An extra 30, 40, 50 bucks every month adds up. It adds up, a, you know, quite fast for people like that. So that's the story on gas prices. It's going to get worse before it gets better, you guys. Uh, wish I had better news. June 6, 2022. Bill Chappelle from NPR. And that's the uh, $5 a gallon up to 7 and change in California. Hopefully you don't shoot the messenger. I apologize. But do hit that like button and subscribe to the channel so you can come back and see more stories. And until the next one, I'll see everyone later.